Hi everyone, and I hope you're all keeping safe and well, given the current global pandemic that we're experiencing. Today, I want to have a look at the Amazon Renew program and the Amazon Warehouse program. Why, you may ask? For the simple reason is that there are subtle differences between the two, and I think it is really important to highlight them so you are better informed when you next want to purchase an item using either program. I can confirm I have used both programs myself and to prove this I will link videos at the end of this video of my experiences of using both programs. Now just to warn you when this video was published you may only see my experience of using the Amazon Renew program and that is because I'm still in the process of finalizing the video of my experience of using the Amazon Warehouse program. But as soon as it's ready, I will link it to this video. With that said, let's get started by looking at the Amazon Renew program. Amazon Renewed is your trusted destination where you can purchase a wide range of products that work and look like new, obviously at a lower cost, and is backed by the Amazon Renew guarantee. So starting from the left, you can expect to get a high quality product which has been professionally inspected tested and cleaned to work and look like new. Then moving on to guaranteed by Amazon and I do want to focus on this area a little bit. So at the bottom there where it says eligible for replacement or refund. Now that refund as I understand it is a full refund within one year of receipt if it does not look like new or work as expected. So going back to that one year, that one year is applicable here in the UK and it's not a global obligation by Amazon. And after liaising with some of you through the comment section, and I really welcome your feedback. For example, in the USA, I've been informed that it is 30 days. So my advice is to check whichever country you're using the program, and that's what you'll have to go by. Okay, then moving on to what's included in the box or the, in the package you're going to receive. You can expect obviously the device, a SIM tool removal, a charger, charging cable, obviously no headphones and no SIM card. Then moving on to better for the planet, as it states there, your Amazon renewed purchase extends the lifetime of the product and reduces electronic waste. And that's something we should all really bear in mind, especially with the global environmental disasters we're all currently experiencing. That was pretty straightforward. Now let's take a look at the Amazon Warehouse Program. With the Amazon Warehouse Program, you are getting a quality pre-owned used product at a discounted price. The product would have been inspected, tested and repaired where necessary. Also, you get a hassle-free return process and a year warranty. In addition, you are also doing your bit for the environment. Before purchasing any item from the Amazon Warehouse Program, it is a good idea to familiarize yourself with the condition or the state the item will be when it arrives. As we have here, we have four descriptions of what you can expect your item to be. So we have used like new, followed by used very good, then used good, and then used acceptable. So again, very important to go through these descriptions so you have a very good idea of what the item will be like when it arrives. And also, I should also highlight, the better the condition, the higher the price. So do keep that in mind. If you're not satisfied with your product, you can return it within 30 days and get a full refund as per Amazon's returns policy. However, if you're not happy after the 30 days, you will not get any refund. Now, this is really important to note because unlike the Amazon Renew program, you can return the item within one year of purchase and get a refund. So again, just to be clear, 
with the Amazon Warehouse program, if you're not satisfied with the item, you do need to return it within 30 days to get a full refund or any refund. Okay, so moving along, where it talks about the warranty rights. So here you are covered for one year for the product. So if it's defective within one year of purchase, you can send it back to Amazon and they will try to replace it with a like for like. And I believe as it states there, only if they cannot replace the item at all, then you'll be entitled to a refund. But whether it's a full or partial refund, I am unsure. But I thought it's important to highlight that point about the warranty rights. So that right, that warranty right is just to return the item to get a replacement if your current item is defective. So again, do keep that in mind. But if you have any questions, please feel free to raise them in the comment section below and I'll be more than happy to respond. So just to conclude, I hope you found the information in this video really useful and now you're able to determine the difference between the Amazon Renew program and the Amazon Warehouse program. But before we go, I just want to leave you with a thought. And that is, we have these two programs running side by side, effectively doing the same thing, which is selling renewed products. But then I was thinking, why have the two that effectively do the same thing? Is this Amazon's way of phasing out the Amazon Renewed program in favor of the Amazon Warehouse program? And the reason why I've come to that conclusion is because with the Amazon Renewed program, you get a one year period, at least here in the UK, where if you're not happy with the item, you can return it and get a full refund. Whereas with the Amazon Warehouse program, you have a 30 day period where if you're not happy, you can return the item and get your money back. So I'll leave you with that food for thought. Anyway, my name is Shola. Thank you for watching and I will see you in another episode. Peace.